Well, hopefully our weather cooperates this April 8th when the total solar eclipse will be partially visible here in Illinois. This is going to become a bigger and bigger deal as Absolutely. we get closer to this. CBS 2's Tara Molina has spent the day at Triton College in the suburbs where scientists are busy gearing up for the big event in a very special way. They started getting ready for the eclipse here at the beginning of this month. With shows running in this planetarium right now, not only on the eclipse and its impact, but how it's been viewed historically. The moon blocks the disk of the sun. Here in the Chicago area, weather permitting, you'll be able to see 94% of the sun eclipsed. 94% of the magic, if you're talking to Chris McCall. A solar eclipse is this magical event where the moon passes between the Earth and the sun. She leads the CERNIN Earth and Space Center at Triton College, and it's safe to say she's passionate about the eclipse. I'm just thinking about the, the magical quality of it, understanding what's happening in the universe. She's a scientist and cultural notice, and historic eclipse expert. Well when the sun is completely blocked by the moon, the atmosphere changes, the air is electric, the insects become silent, birds go to roost. Inside the center, they're running a show in the planetarium on eclipses, history and cultural views, and the best way to view them. All right. Outside, demonstrating the safest way to view the eclipse with utensils you probably have in your kitchen right now. You would see little crescent suns. Even the pantry. The pinholes in a Ritz cracker will project the eclipse onto your hand or onto the ground. Whatever you choose to use to view it, she says preparation is important because this won't happen again for more than 20 years. The next total solar eclipse across the United States, not until 2045. If you want to see a total solar eclipse and you don't want to have to travel at all, mark your calendar now for September the 14th, 2099, there will be a total solar eclipse visible from Chicago. Do calendars even go out that far, Chris? Uh, <laughs> yes, they do. This one, just 26 days away. A great spectacle, a phenomena. This eclipse expert will be experiencing for the first time in totality after more than 40 years in the field. It's an opportunity to be one with the universe, to share this experience with other people. They'll be hosting events here throughout the day, the day of the eclipse, that's April 8th. We put more information on that and how you can safely view the eclipse from wherever you'll be in the story that's up on our website right now. Reporting inside the CERNIN Earth and Space Center on Triton College's campus, I'm Tara Molina, CBS2 News. Our thanks to Tara, and if you don't want to travel, stick with us here at CBS News Chicago. We'll have plenty of eclipse coverage on that day and leading up to it. Have you ordered your Ritz glasses yet? I will now. <laughs> You'll be putting them on. <laughs> look, look for that in our live coverage. Yeah.